the mother. The holy mother of all the mothers in the yeah. whole motherland. What up, y'all? It's April G. Showers back at y'all with a reaction. We got Johnny and Clyde the story lyric video. Super excited. I've reacted to something of Clyde's before. It was his Merkham's State Your Name Challenge. And it was really dope. The dude can spit. The dude can write. The dude has bars out the ass. Entendres, wordplay, all that. So I'm super, super, super excited. This was requested by Johnny and Clyde. So thank you so much, Johnny and Clyde. Appreciate you. As always, I will provide the link in the description box. So please be sure to click on that link. Go watch, like, comment, share, subscribe. All that wonderful stuff after my reaction. Y'all, please subscribe. Even if just 10% of my subscribers, just 10%. Of y'all would go over and subscribe to my dear friend. They would have over a thousand subscribers. So help me to get them to that thousand. All right, y'all. Three minutes, 43 seconds. April G. Squad. Fist bump. Love y'all. Let's get it. Bro, look, when I was laid up, Johnny came through with a notebook and a pen and told me to write it out, but I was... When I was laid up, Johnny came through with a notebook and a pen and told me to write it out, but I was so shook, but I connected to me. Is he already paying homage? Am I tripping? Am I reaching? Bro, look. When I was laid up, Johnny came through with a notebook and a pen and told me to write it out, but I was so shook. But I connected through meditation and wrote some dope books and got the motivation to rhyme and then the flow took over like a 45 turn a record over like a keepsake. They took too much blood and the flow took over like a 45. And the flow took over like a 45 turn over. I turned the record over. Turn the record over like a keepsake. You youngins. Won't understand that. The little 45 records, you know, and it had record players and a little needle that you put on it to play the bitch. Yeah, them shits. A lot of people won't understand what that is. I remember those days. Got the motivation to rhyme and then the flow took over like a 45 turn a record over like a keepsake they took too much blood it got me colder seemed like a thousand years I didn't come to get hurt I was cold ain't that a shame all I wanted was a sweatshirt yo I wasn't ready to go underneath the ground but I'll keep motivation to rhyme I feel like I'm missing a lot but I was so shook But I connected through meditation And wrote some dope books And got the motivation to rhyme And then the flow took over Like a 45 turn a record over Like a keepsake they Cause there's a 45 record But a 45's also a gun He said like a keepsake The rhyme and then the flow took over Like a 45 turn a record over Like a keepsake they took too much blood It got me colder Like a keepsake they took too much blood. It got me colder. That's a double. First of all, the literal meaning. If you lose a lot of blood, also what's called hypovolemia, you'll be cold. It makes literally makes you cold. But then they took too much blood. It got me colder. It's like so many people effed him over, screwed him over, hurt him. All that, and it made him cold on the inside. It made him cold, like cold hearted. You know what I'm saying? Over like a 45, turn a record over like a keepsake. They took too much blood, it got me colder. Seemed like a thousand years, I didn't come to get hurt. I was cold, ain't that a shame? All I wanted was a sweatshirt. Yo, I wasn't ready to go. On. I was cold, ain't that a shame? All I wanted was a sweatshirt. Is that a Earl sweatshirt bar, or am I tripping? Let me know, Johnny and Clyde. 
Seem like a thousand years I didn't come to get hurt I was cold, ain't that a shame All I wanted was a sweatshirt Yo, I wasn't ready to go underneath the ground I was just looking for answers When the doctors came around Selected poems, what I had To avoid the dark places And I squeezed the story out Like it was blood on straight paper We had to stay vicious We did it when we were young And like a boxer, I stay ready Anytime y'all bring it on I bring the American slang That's where I'm coming from And we were orphans before We were the sons of these songs Listen We were orphans before we were the sons of these songs. That's a double. We were orphans, like, they didn't have any parents, any guardians before they were the sons of these songs. The music became their guardian. The music became their protector, their, you know what I'm saying? But also, if you want to go deeper, sons of these songs, he could be paying homage to all the artists that came before him that paved the way for him and calling them like the father and him the son. Get what I'm saying? I could be reaching there, but it would make sense. Let me go all the way back. Don't like it? Deuces. Turn the record over like a keepsake They took too much blood, it got me colder Seemed like a thousand years, I didn't come to get hurt I was cold, ain't that a shame All I wanted was a sweatshirt, yo I wasn't ready to go underneath the ground I was just looking for answers when the doctors came around Selected poems, what I had to avoid the dark places and So he he's saying he's looking for answers When the doctors came around So was you really, was you really ill? Did you really have a disease? Or you said 45, did you get shot? Did you have an illness? Or did you have some type of blood disorder or illness? Let me know. Just looking for answers when the doctors came around. Selected poems, what I had to avoid the dark. Selected poems, what I had to avoid the dark places. Writing. I've always said what? Prayer. Writing and music is my therapy. And that's basically what he's saying. Writing these poems, these lyrics, was his therapy, was his escape from the dark places, from the depression, from the effed up thoughts. You know what I'm saying? From what he was going through, the trauma. You know what I'm saying? The hurt, the pain, the grief, you know? I was just looking for answers when the doctors came around Selected poems, what I had to avoid the dark places And I squeezed the story out like it was blood on straight paper And I squeezed the story out like it was blood on straight paper Damn on straight paper we had to stay vicious we did it when we were young and like a boxer i stay ready anytime y'all bring it on i bring the american slang that's where i'm coming from and we were orphans before we were the sons of these songs listen i got one chance in life i plan on doing it right i got a new appreciation y'all and i got skills so i ain't sitting on it like a breaking ball i got one chance in life i plan on doing it right I got a new appreciation, y'all, and I got skills, so I ain't sitting on it like a breaking ball. So let me hop back up on the rhyme scheme and take your back in the track and tell you why I be. Three weeks in the hospital, hooked up to an IV. My kidneys failed. They went the way of PHI free. I'm so sorry that happened to you, but I am so grateful you made it through it and you're still with us and here and I commend you for your bravery, your strength. To be so open and honest and real and raw about what you went through. Anytime an artist does that and talks about real life-ish that they went through. That's very painful. That's very difficult to talk about. But they do it anyway. They put it down on paper. Then they lay it on a track. And then they put it out for the world to hear. That makes my level of respect for an artist go from here to infinity. There is no top. You know what I'm saying? So respect for that. His kidneys fell. They went the way of PHI free. 
your pH balance. Just look up pH balance. Just Google it. I won't get into all that, but I know what you're talking about. I was a nurse for 20 years. I, I get what you're saying. I can tell you why I be three weeks in the hospital hooked up to an IV. My kidneys failed. They went the way of pH. I'm free. I got a family and all me to an IV. My kidneys failed. They went the way of pH. My kidneys failed, they went the way of PHI free, and then down here in parentheses, he puts freeway. So, there's PH balance, there is no I, it's PH balance, but he said PHI free. Now, because I reacted to his state your name challenge, I do know Clyde is from Philadelphia, Philly. P-H-I, is that what you're talking about? Freeway, he keep put freeway in parentheses, P-H-I free, like the Philadelphia freeway. Is that what you're talking about? Bro, in my trip, I probably sound so dumb in this fucking reaction. I'm so sorry. I be three weeks in the hospital, hooked up to an IV. My kidneys failed. They went the way of PHI free. I got a family and on me, they were lying. And if I'm really dying, I ain't vibing with the time. And yo, I thought this man was dying. He kept screaming, why me? But nah, nah, I knew I'd be getting back up like the I3s. I needed to hear this. I'm about to cry now, bruh. He said, I got a family, and on me, they were lying. Family, and on me, they were lying. And if I'm really dying, I ain't vibing with the timing. And if I'm really dying, I ain't vibing with the timing. Yo, I thought... Yo, I thought this man was dying. He kept screaming, why me? This man was dying. He kept screaming, why me? But not I. I knew I'd be getting back up like that. But not I. I knew I'd be getting back up. Like the I threes. That's a bar. First off. Second off. Wow. That's very inspirational and motivational. And I needed to hear that. So thank you. And yo, I thought this man was dying. He kept screaming, why me? But nah, nah, I knew I'd be getting back up like the I-3s. They said, could you be loved? You could bet your you ass I could. Love. My family and my friends stood in a place where disaster stood. I had questions. I didn't have answers. Shit was growing on my organs. They was testing me for cancers. I was fucked up for a minute. I had to get the shit out on the day of the birth of Jackson. They told me I could get out. I'm gonna cry for real, bro. On the day of the birth of Jackson, they told me I could get out. My son's name is Jackson. Questions. I didn't have answers. Shit was growing on my organs. They was testing me for cancers. I was fucked up for a minute. I had to get the shit out on the day of the birth of Jackson. They told me I could get out. I came back uplifted and feeling gifted. See, I slowed my life down and now I'm living much differently. I take some time to breathe, some time for meditation. Negativity, nah. Every day is celebration, y'all. You got one chance in life. I hope you're doing it right. Ain't got no time to be patient, y'all, cause life is gonna pass while you stand around waiting, y'all. You got one chance in life. I hope you're doing it right. Ain't got no time to be patient, y'all, cause life is gonna pass while you stand around waiting, y'all. I'm on a whole. And that whole, I ain't got no time to be patient, y'all. That could be a double. Patient, as in, I've been patiently waiting for a track to. That's all I could think of. I can't help it. I think in music lyrics. <laughs> patient. You know, like you're patient. You're calm. You're patient. But also, he's been talking this whole time about how he was sick. He was in a hospital. So, like a hospital. Patient. It's in life. It's in life. I hope you're doing it right. Doing it right. Ain't got no time to be patient, y'all, cause life is gonna pass while you stand around waiting, y'all. I'm on a whole different vibration, eyes wide open, talking full dilation, and my rhymes stay fine like a traffic citation. They get done when they get... My eyes stay fine like a traffic citation, a fine. If you get a traffic citation or ticket, you pay a fine. 
open, talking full dilation. And my rhymes stay fine like a traffic citation. They get done when they get done. Procrastination. I ain't gaslighting y'all, just some admiration. Manifesting good things in my life. Invitation. Yo, I speak. I like the way he's enunciating and putting emphasis on I. I. Listen to how he, he's putting the enunciation on I. Check it. I'm on a whole different vibration, eyes wide open, talking full dilation, and my rhymes stay fine like a traffic citation, they get done when they get done, procrastination, I ain't gaslighting y'all, just some admiration, manifesting good things in my life, invitation, yo, I speak unity if you catch it my word, cause I ain't left or right wing, I'm the whole fucking bird, if left or right wing, I'm the whole fucking bird. Same here, homie. Oh, don't get me on that soapbox. That's why I don't identify as a certain political party. Because I believe that's just another way or another thing that they use to divide us. Political parties. You're either Republican or Democrat. Left or right. Red or or blue. They use all sorts of things to divide us. For the jab or not for the jab. Pro-life, pro-choice. Pro-Second Amendment against Second Amendment. I mean, it's so much shit they use to divide us. And what's sad is the vast majority of people, not all, but the vast majority of people feed right into it and allow it to happen the elites the governments regardless of who's in office i don't give a flying fizz up who the potus is and let's be real the potus really don't have as much power as people think he does he's just a fucking puppet for the elites let's just be real but Regardless of who the POTUS is, it don't matter who it is, right or left, it don't matter. Every single one of them's M.O. is the exact same thing, divide and conquer. And they use mainstream media to do that. The fake news that you watch where 99.9% .9 of it is bullshit anyway that's like y'all just some admiration manifesting good things in my life invitation yo i speak unity if you catch it my word cause i ain't left or right wing i'm the whole fucking bird if you watch too much news and your vision is blurred while we rock zips from four what the fuck did i just say if you watch too much news then your vision is blurred Bitch, what did I just say? That's crazy. I'm the whole fucking bird. If you watch too much news and your vision is blurred, while we rock zips from 480 to 623, then we roll 520 and 928. It's ludicrous. We're spreading love, homie. Why you hate? And if you really want to be a force for good and make a difference, focus on your action, not affiliation to religions. It don't matter, race and right. Force for good and make a difference. Ludicrous. We're spreading love, homie. Why you hate? And if you really want to be a force for good and way, this we rock zips from 480 to 623, then we roll 520 and 928. It's ludicrous. That just hit me. That bar just knocked me the fuck out. He was just rapid different area codes. And he said it's ludicrous. Ludicrous song area codes. That was fire. Then he said we spread love, homie. Why you hate? We spread in love, homie. Why you hate? And if you really want to be a force for good and make it... And if you really want to be a force for good and make a difference, difference, focus on your action. Focus on your actions, not affiliation to religions. Facts, facts, and more motherfucking facts. Not affiliation to religions, it don't matter race or identity. We're all human. Let's change our intentions and energy and start to prove it. Yeah. I got one chance in life. 
I plan on doing it right. I got a new appreciation, y'all, and I got skills, so I ain't sitting on it like a breaking ball. I got one chance in life. I plan on doing it right. And I don't listen what they saying, y'all, cause I got skill and you can write it down. I'm gonna make it, y'all. I'm gonna, I'm gonna make it, y'all. Johnny and Clyde's gonna make it, y'all. Yo, I'm gonna make it, y'all. That was fire. The beat was fire. Every verse was fire. Delivery fire. Flowing cadence fire. Bars on Tadra's wordplay, rhyme schemes, all that fire. Substance fire. That is, oh my gosh, bro. How many views does this got? This is ridiculous. This was put out a year ago. It's got 327 views and 22 likes. I liked it before I started recording. Y'all, please, 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 please. Click on the link in the description box. Go give it a view. Like it. Comment on it. Share it. And subscribe. Please. Come on, bruh. This dude bared his soul. He talks about how he was sick. He was in a dark place. How writing and music brought him out of that dark place. Now he's using his gift of writing and music to motivate, encourage, uplift, inspire others. Come on, bro. This was amazing. I absolutely love it. I need to know if it's on Spotify immediately because I want to put it on like seven different playlists and I ain't playing. And if it ain't on Spotify, get it on there. <laughs> but y'all, that's my thoughts. Y'all comment below y'all's thoughts. What did y'all think of the song as a whole. What did y'all think of the video, the beat, the lyrics, the bars, the rhyme schemes, the wordplay, the substance, the flow and cadence and delivery, my reactions slash breakdown. Be real. Be respectful, please. But be real. Thank you once again, Johnny and Clyde, for requesting this. Appreciate you so so very much and you are absolutely right you are gonna make it i believe it with my whole heart that you are and i wouldn't just say that bro if i thought you wouldn't know good i wouldn't like trash you or nothing because i like you <laughs> but i would say yo man you need to work on this or you need to you know what i'm saying but but you you got it bro you got your pen is phenomenal your flow and cadence is phenomenal and this is just phenomenal i loved it absolutely loved it so thank you once again for requesting this and i hope it's on spotify but y'all, like I said, click on the link and please go watch it, like it, comment on it, share it, subscribe. Please, 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 please like this video on your way out a lot more important than you think. And please subscribe to my channel, y'all. All right, y'all. April G. Squad. Fist bump. Love y'all.
and I'll see y'all in just a little bit. Peace out.